welcome to english class today i am going to teach you english of a standard 7 section 1 uncovering the ghost of nancy drew and here is a new lesson that is about the sixth unit uncovering the ghost of nancy drew and uh, it was uh, written by pamila debrea and uh, uncovering the ghost of nancy drew that lesson stands have you ever read a nancy drew book who was a nancy drew and if you call, recall nancy uh, nancy drew is a girl detective in an american mystery fiction series created by publisher edward stremer in 1930 as the female counterpoint of his hardy uh, hardy boys series of nancy drew is a detective uh, of american mystery fiction and here and he uh, who uh, actually wrote nancy drew books remain a mystery here he had uh, described uh, who wrote nancy drew, uh, drew books that's the name uh, here is not a uh, clear who wrote this book let's uh, start our lesson what would you do if you discovered a secret message scribed inside a library book you if you get a secret book from this library and a scry here some message also and what if, if it was a clue to a mystery you are trying to solve about that uh, that book uh, you get a clue from that book to find a mystery അതായത് നമുക്കിപ്പം മാൻസി ഡ്രൂവിൻ്റെ ബുക്കുകളൊക്കെ കഥകളൊക്കെ എഴുതുന്നു പക്ഷെ യഥാർത്ഥത്തിലുള്ള ഓദറല്ല പറഞ്ഞിരിക്കുന്ന ആൾ അങ്ങനെ ഒരാളില്ല പക്ഷെ ആ വേറെ ആരാണ് എഴുതുന്നത് അപ്പോൾ അങ്ങനെ നമ്മൾ ഫൈൻ ചെയ്യാനായിട്ട് ഇരിക്കുമ്പോഴാണ് ലൈബ്രറി ബുക്കിൽ നിന്ന് ഒരു ക്ലൂ കിട്ടുന്നത് അപ്പം ഹൗ ടു സോൾവ് ദാറ്റ് പ്രോബ്ലം ഇൻ നയൻറ്റീൻ എ യങ് ലൈബ്രറി വർക്കർ നെയിംഡ് ജെഫ്രി ലാപ്പിൽ discovered something mysterious about a favorite book detective that time 1963 a library worker his name was jeffrey lapin i uh, discovered to find the mysterious about this detective nancy drew uh, mystery mysterious here means something se- secret or unknown but uh, here is a some uh, we want to find uh, some mysterious secret or mysterious things about nancy drew library records stated that no one knew who had written the stories about her that uh, the important thing is no one knew who wrote these uh, stories that is the main things the author's name on the book read caroline king that uh, uh, someone who wrote about nancy drew uh, 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 stories his name was written that is caroline king but some people said there was no such a person carolyn king edittund pakshe ellavarum parayna angane or author illa then the only printed fact jeffrey could find said carolyn king real name unknown kappa edarthathil carolyn king nalla a real name endanu arivilla then jeffrey found a clue a message inside a baltimore library book at this time jeffrey find a message from this baltimore library book right next to the name caroline p someone had pencil to another name margaret work that is a uh, then he get a uh, clue from that the library book at the end they write the name of the author that is caroline king and uh, someone had a uh, right the pencil to another name apo ഓദറിൻ്റെ യഥാർത്ഥത്തിലുള്ള പേരിൻ്റെ താഴെ പെൻസിൽ കൊണ്ട് വേറൊരു പേര് അവിടെ എഴുതി വെച്ചിട്ടുണ്ട് അത് എന്നാണ് മാൽറെഡ് എന്നുള്ള പേരാണ് അപ്പോൾ ആരാണ് മാൽറെഡ് ആൻഡ് ഹാഡ് അനദർ ടു ഓൾസോ ദറ്റ് ഈസ് സി അമേരിക്കൻ മൂമൺ ദറ്റ് ഈസ് എ നയൻറ്റീൻ തേർട്ടി നയൻ ഫോർട്ടി അപ്പം അനദർ ബുക്സ് നെയിം ഓൾസോ റൈറ്റ് ദർ ദറ്റ് ഈസ് എ അമേരിക്കൻ വിമൻ ദെൻ ദീസ് ആർ ദ ക്ലൂ ഗെറ്റ് ഫ്രം ജെഫി ആൻഡ് ഹു ഓസ് എ മാൽറെഡ് and arani malred and uh, it is seen as if jeffrey uh, jeffrey's old chum for uh, nancy drew was whispering to his ear and uh, uh, jeffrey's friend uh, that is a uh, who uh, that is nancy drew he had to solve this mystery and uh, jeffrey decided to solve this mystery to find the secret about this uh, 
book that is a who decided jeffrey quickly he located a book american uh, women then for he first he found the book american women and uh, what he found there must have made him catch his breath what is the meaning of catch his breath that is stop breathing that is a uh, because for a moment because of a surprise അതിശയം കൊണ്ട് ആ അങ്ങനെ ശ്വാസം അടക്കി നിൽക്കുകയില്ല അത് അതാണ് ക്യാച്ച് ഹിസ് ബ്രേക്ക് എന്തോ കണ്ടിട്ട് സമൺ നെയിം മൈൽഡ് വേർഡ് ബെൻസൺ ഹെയർ മാരീഡ് നെയിം അത് ഫ്രം ദീസ് അമേരിക്കൻ വിമൻ ദറ്റ് ബുക്ക് ഹി ഗെറ്റ് നെയിം മൈൽഡ് വേർഡ് ബെൻസൺ ദറ്റ്സ് ഫുൾ നെയിം ഐ ഹാഡ് റിട്ടൺ മോർ ദൻ ഹൺഡ്രഡ് ആൻഡ് തേർട്ടി ചിൽഡ്രൻസ് ബുക്ക്സ് ഹു വാസ് ഇസ് മൈൽഡ് ഹു റോട്ട് അബൌട്ട് വൺ തേർട്ടി ബുക്ക്സ് ആൻഡ് he had uh, used the pseudonyms that is a uh, uh, was carolyn king one of the made up authors name she had used uh, mildred and all that and the 130 children's book edited and he used the pseudonyms that is a tuliya mama nok parayil ah vera oru peru illa aa peru edana carolyn king nalla peru ana adeh upayogichirikkunu avar upayogichirikkunu if so why would she hide her ട്രൂ ഐഡൻറ്റിറ്റി എന്തിനാണ് അവർ യഥാർത്ഥ പേര് മറച്ച് വെച്ച് എഴുതുന്നത് അതായത് വിത്ത് എ പേഴ്സൺ നോട്ട് റിവീൽ ദ റിയൽ നെയിം റിയൽ നെയിം എന്തിനാണ് മറച്ചു വെക്കുന്നത് ആൻഡ് വാട്ട് വുഡ് നാൻ സി ലുക്ക് ഫോർ നക്സ് നൈൻ ആൻഡ് ടു ഫൈൻഡ് ദ സ്റ്റോറീസ് അബൌട്ട് നാൻ സി അതർ തിങ്സ് വി വാണ്ട് ദറ്റ് ഈസ് ഫിംഗർ പ്രിൻസ് ആൻഡ് ദ ഓതേഴ്സ് റൈറ്റിംഗ് സ്റ്റൈൽ ഈസ് ലൈക്ക് ലൈക്ക് ഫിംഗർ പ്രിൻസ് ഹിയർ യൂസ് ദ വിത്ത് വിത്ത് ദ വാട്ട് ഇസ് ഫിംഗർ പ്രിൻസ് ദറ്റ് ഈസ് റൈറ്റിംഗ് സ്റ്റൈൽ writing style means here the features of a book writing that make it a typical of a particular writer the writing style of a particular person can be identified with the uh, writing style and uh, no one else could duplicate it exactly appo namal duplicate undakkan pattathile writing style so if jeffrey found margaret's other books he would compare them with the nancy drew's books then the uh, Yeah, if uh, Jeffrey can found the Mildred's other books, he can compare these uh, two books, Nancy Drew's uh, real books and uh, the Mildred's uh, real book. Then come, uh, come through these uh, antique stories and master bookshelves and Jeffrey uh, said he had truly found a gold mine. Then and he found uh, different uh, books from the shelves. That antique stories here means shops that sell things that are old and often valuable. Then he found the old books from the shops. And Jeffrey said he had truly found a gold mine. That is a book written by the old times. That is the old books of this mind rush. Or, or he can find from somewhere. and yes every book he had read mildred was filled with the word uh, pictures similar to those he had read nancy drew's books he found some books uh, and uh, these pictures are same that uh, nancy drew's books and mildred books are same pictures and secret pass- passages country roads and road stairs and uh, what the way through the books he found just as they did a popular series it was as if nancy was having the adventures under the name of other characters and mildred had written those adventures using different authors names uh, nancy or adventures that the books lady to the mildred adupola adventures vera oru perilum ezhuditundu was write the same things same pictures used to that only mildred could reveal this secret jeffrey arrives and interview uh, with the home mildred then at this time jeffrey decided to take an interview with the mildred the moment they met he felt he as if he were talking nancy to herself and a long time reporter for the told blade and mildred had been taking in her blood and just as nancy did and a reporter here is to uh, that is uh, a person who write about the news uh, or newspaper here the newspaper newspaper's name blade told of blade and uh, discover uh, detecting hints uh, here means discovery discovering uh, what about this nancy joseph uh, books 
and a myriad rock molds of what people thought women should do. And she was the first woman to graduate from the University of Iowa School of Journalism. In 1927, she received the first master's degree in the school ever gave. What about this? Uh, this is a myriad. And her adventurous life including becoming a pilot and champion dive, uh, diver and a swimmer. That is uh, uh, about this uh, Margaret. She was uh, the first woman graduate. Then she studied at the School of Journalism. Then she received the first master's degree. And uh, he had an adventurous uh, life also. He was a great interest in a uh, dive, uh, diving and swimmer. And he was also become a uh, wanted to become a pilot also. That about uh, this class. I do read the uh, lesson well. And so first part uh, of a uh, uh, ghost of Nancy Drew is over. Do read it well. Thank you.